literally at the end of the game, this dude was still out there making everyone's life hell. Oh. At the end of a 14-2 game, you couldn't let up, could you, Dom? No, I mean, uh, you know, coach preaches all the time. You know, you got to push, 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 and, you know, um, we don't let up. You know, that's not who we are, and I don't think uh, that's how we want to play. You know, we want to be fast and on the go all the time, so, you know. Can't let up ever. Uh, yeah, can't ever let up. So, Dom, you've had your hands full to start the season. You know, you get six top 20 opponents. You've typically guarded the number one attackman on each team. So it's you know no sleep for the weary for you. What what has it meant for you to be able to garner those assignments and then you know get a game tonight where you've had you know a lot of success? Um, I mean, it, it feels good. I mean, we want those games. We want to play the the top fives. I mean, I I loved it. You know, that's that's a big reason why I came here is because you know. Uh, you know, we get to play uh, practice against and with the best every day. And, you know, when we actually go out there and play a game, you know, I want to play the best. And uh, you know, it means a lot to get, go against the best guys. And, um, you know, we didn't have as much success as we wanted to. But, you know, to have a game like this to come back for uh, defensively is, uh, is really good. Dom, obviously, short of winning games, what do you guys need to do between now and when you get back to tournament time in order to be ready to go beat those teams in the NCAA tournament when you get those opportunities again against the best teams in the country? I'll just go back to the film and uh, just learn from our mistakes. I think we just got to be more consistent. You know, uh, sometimes I think we uh, have the same mistakes happen in games, and it's, you know, it can be frustrating. And then you get yourself in, uh, inside your own head. But, um, you know, just mentally really get there. I mean, athletically, you know, we, there's not anybody that we've played that we thought, you know, they were just faster or stronger than us. You know, we just made a couple of uh, mental mistakes. And, you know, those are the fixable ones, and those are the ones that we really know um, once we get them. I mean, we're, we're, we're very excited to play any one of those teams that we lost to again. So. Absolutely. Don, can you get Nick Rossi any free swag? Can you I'll do, do my best. Yeah, I'll you know, I like it. I like it. I'll do my best. That's what he needs. Get me one of these ties. <laughs> like, yeah. 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 You got to see the jacket he actually wore tonight. It yeah, is. There you go. It is a winner. Yeah. That, I'm not even kidding about it. It's amazing. <laughs> Don DeFazio, congratulations on a big win tonight. Thanks for coming up and hanging out with us. Appreciate it. Thank you, guys. Thanks. He is Dom DeFazio checking in here on the All Access Post Game Show after.